degrees in Manchester this morning. Midlife crisis begins. I guess it's about 10 hours since I recorded anything. Dubai Airport, um, 30 degrees hotter here outside, but I haven't been outside because it's late. Uh, tired. Two hour sit and off to Bangkok. Back in Thailand then. I forgot to say yes to everything here. There's a clothes shop up here where I can get a t-shirt. Maybe. Uh, I'm in Bangkok. I don't know if my luggage is. It might be, but it might, might be waiting for me. It might not go on the plane to Phnom Penh, but they just say yes. And I don't have a boarding pass. But that is okay. They just say yes, so that's fine. Uh, five and a half hours from Dubai to here. My trousers are broken. Sexy. Shit five and a half hours on an A380. Because the numpty next to me must have been Korean. He was doing the Gangnam style. This is why it took so long for the waitress to bring coffee. Desk, table, four poster settee. I don't know, four poster bed. It's not quite homes under the hammer this, is it? Place where I drop my shit. No, oh, there's a place where I drop my shit. Hang on. This is where, in the 70s, I don't mean this hotel, I mean this country, in the 70s where all the fine bathroom suites went to when we stopped buying them. Uh, to the balcony. It gets hot now. Uh, it isn't sunny. Uh, it's five, half past five in the evening. So monsoon is on its way over there. There's dark clouds in the distance and blue sky sort of up there this is a, a dreamy gazing into the distance just because I do that 4 o'clock in the morning heading thousands of people that just poke up through the ground. Uh, obviously it's early in the morning and it's closed uh, and it's kind of jungle really uh, as you can probably hear and the, uh, the moon's still out somewhere. Uh, me and the tuk-tuk driver forced the gate and now I'm in here behind the razor wire I'm waiting for the sunrise, but it's there through those trees. So maybe we will, maybe we won't. <sighs> Weird. And a lot of still water, so I kind of worry about mozzies. You can't see. 
see the ripples maybe on the surface, but I think it's probably just mozzy skimming. But I'm covered in DEET and with any luck won't get too much malaria. Whoa. I've just documented then what, uh, if I was a lovey artist, you'd call the final sunrise. But really, it is the last sunrise lots of people saw through the razor wire. Um, I was wrong earlier when I said tens of thousands of people's bones are walked through. It's actually millions, a quarter of the population. You can Google the rest. I ought to do this because I, I, I haven't I didn't, uh, didn't do any yesterday. Uh, back in the old room, boom, four poster sofa, four poster bed. I sleep in long time. Nice. Um, waiting for a thunderstorm. Out the window, no thunderstorm yet. But you never know. There might be one while I'm asleep. Uh, yesterday, amazing food in an amazing. I felt like Rick Stein restaurant, I told you. Uh, traditional, I was the white boy, the only white boy in the whole restaurant. And it was brilliant. And then that black like, barbecued beef, cook it yourself, butter and fat and a bit of chili and some bamboo sauce. I don't really know what it was, uh, but right nice. Brilliant, and oh, pak choy, mushroom. And then on, Tuk Tuk Driver's idea, shady club, on pontoons, in the Mekong, searched for guns, no, cursory search of the only white boy for guns on the way into the club floating on the river down the rickety gangplank. And um, it's a bit funky, only white boy, liked it. That's all really. I'm going to do safe. Kamai Amok Dry. Fish. Coconut fish stew steamed with boiled rice. There you go. Seems only right as I've flown this bloody tripod 10,000 miles across the earth. Good news, it's a storm coming. Hope you like thunder. You 
so there's something quite different about here and I can't quite put my finger on it. It's like a village city or a city village because there are enough dirty parts and dangerous parts and go-go bar parts but then I'm looking over my balcony now on Sunday which is the, the busiest night of the week for locals and everyone smiles it's fantastic they're looking up at me on my balcony now they don't know I'm talking to this they're looking up at me on my balcony now and they just look up and smile like happy uh, and it's really really nice and it's very very hot it's a mere 37 degrees right now in the shade um, two days ago it was 39 in the shade which was uh, higher than body temperature so you couldn't actually cool down you just got hotter and hotter I didn't sleep much that day or night but good thing because it's blown the storms up and it's the start of the monsoon season and I'll show you some pictures of some lightning in the far distance now and if we're lucky we might get a nice storm